Hey friends, happy Saturday. Mm. So I look like I've been asleep, right? Baby, I just had the best massage in my entire life. Besides the one I had in DR, baby, the ones in DR at Hard Rock. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. So, handy dandy lash brush so I can file my 10 lashes that I have left. That's the only bad thing about having your lashes done when you go get a massage, like new lashes. Like, these I don't care about, so I lay face down. But when you have new lashes, um, I'll be having to turn to the side because obviously that will get smashed. So, we're about to run to um, Target real quick. And I need, I'm going out with my friends tonight. So, I need a um, summertime foundation. And I really need a Sephora. But I don't feel like going to Sephora because it's in the opposite direction. But I'm going to go there and just see if I can find me some um, foundation that matches my summer skin tone. Because I'm a little bit darker than you, Zhao. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, friends. Aren't those safe lights? So, <laughs> no. Okay, so these are the sconces off of TV2 that we're going to go with. I'll show y'all a better picture. But they're going to illuminate up and down. It's kind of like what you see like in a living room or maybe in the theater room. But we like it for this area. So they'll be like, I think this is like 10 to 12 inches away from each side of the wall, right? The picture, this one right here is going to be centered in the middle, spaced correctly. This is how far down we're going to have this picture go. I didn't measure or mark where how how hot up it goes, but it's underneath the what's the name? Anyways, down here, this is new. We're gonna do a console from West Elm that's cream, similar to the one I was gonna get for the entryway. So it is 30 inches high, which is marked there. So that's gonna be the distance between the picture and the console. So it's enough room to decorate and put like vases or whatever on there. And then it's 60 inches wide, which I have another one over here. It's not all centered. Um, babe, can you just really quickly hold the picture up so they can see what it's gonna look like? Come down. So y'all get the idea. So just picture those two sconces there, like illuminating up and down. So it'll illuminate up to the ceiling and then down, which is gonna show um, the um, illuminate on the console. The console won't be here until, you can take it down. So the console won't be here until December, January. So I was like, it'll be a nice Christmas present for us. But y'all know my couch is from West Elm. My bar stools are from West Elm. So I have confidence. And with confidence in West Elm, but not in TV2. So, anyways, it's time for dinner. Bye. Good morning, you all. Happy Monday, honey. I'm looking a greasy hot mess, y'all. I had to do some extra moisturizer because my face has been feeling kind of like dry and stuff. But anyways, y'all, when I tell y'all I'm on a struggle bus this morning, I could not fall asleep last night for nothing in the world. I probably went to sleep at like one o'clock. I had made, you know, told myself it's the last week of June, the beginning of, slash the beginning of July. Like it's gonna be productive. We're gonna start sticking to our schedule. Girl, my body woke me up at like 8.14 this morning. I was supposed to be up at 5.30. But the other thing that I'm practicing is giving myself more grace but that's just a lot of grace i feel like god dang it i just ran a red light i really hope that's not a, a flash and <sighs> i really want to call out of work today um just take a mental health day because i don't know i'm just not feeling it anyways i'm headed to get groceries um I made, one thing I did yesterday was basically made our meals for the week or made a list of what our meals for the week are going to be for like breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, so I'll show y'all everything whenever I get home.
Lainey? Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh gosh, my back, Lord. So anyways, um, I basically wrote down a map out, whatever you want to call it, breakfast, lunch, and dinner for every single day this week. And then I grocery shopped according to what our meals were for the week. I didn't buy a whole bunch of just, excuse me, meats and fruits and veggies and stuff because I realized at the end of the week, I'm throwing like half of that stuff out. So hopefully this works. Um, can somebody bring me my phone? It's over there on the couch. I want to show you all my breakfast for this morning because I probably, if you follow me on Instagram, you've seen it. But girl, I was so hungry. I didn't have time to do the video of it. And I was just tired. Like, I don't even know what the, the content of this video looked like right now. And then the kids you didn't get up until like, what, 12 something? I wasn't even going to bother trying to get them up. Because they were still woke late at night. Here's what it looks like. And y'all see what time it was when I took that picture. That's how late I was actually eating breakfast this morning. Anyway, so we are doing... Um, some Hello Fresh meals this week. This one's crisp, crispy kicking cayenne chicken cutlet. So that's what it's gonna look like. Broccoli mashed tighter. Can I have this? <laughs> Bean, <laughs> you hold this one. She said, girl. And then this one is hoisin honey chicken. I think that's how you say it. So if you've never had Hello Fresh before, you should try it out. People be giving out so many different like uh, coupon codes and stuff for HelloFresh where you get so many meals free. And I say free because, you know, sometimes it's only for like a single meal and you have to, you have to do it according to how many people are in your family that you're trying to feed. We've done HelloFresh, I don't know how many times before. We'll do it and then we end up wasting the meals because we're eating out and we don't feel like cooking. But now, girl. I hear the clacking of the nails. We are trying to like just stay more on a strict budget. Like we really are. So like one of the things um, that I'm trying to do is, or not even I'm, we, is really like when it comes to the cleaning service, y'all know we already stopped the whole lawn care service with the cleaning service. I think I'm gonna cut back to them only coming once a month because I'm not satisfied with the services, honestly. and. I, I do like that they come and clean because it does help me that they're not, you know, I don't have to clean from scratch. I hate cleaning toilets. Like, I just hate it with a passion. But, like, the shower and stuff this last time, I'm just tired of complaining. I am. So, it's like, you want to do it right? Do it yourself. So, I'll probably cut back to them coming, like, once a month. Um, and then I just clean it the other. Because they were coming every two weeks. So, now I would just... Change it to once a month. You, girl, you can't eat that. Somebody commented on my last video and was like, why is the baby eating plastic? Y'all. <laughs> she gets into everything. I said it in the last video. She literally will get into everything. We watch the baby, but sometimes she grabs something before I can even get to it. Like, my house is not 100% proof of you. So I'm just going to get into it, even if you put it away sometimes I get to it. But Bean and my other kids are alive and well. Okay. I had to edit the video. Clearly, I seen it. Anyways, I'm about to start making my lunch. So, I'll let y'all see what that looks like when I get it done. Do I look like, do I, look like I need a nap? Because I do.
empty wall. I want to tell y'all FedEx and got lazy. They stay putting stuff at the dog on um driveway. So I ordered a lamp. Y'all know Target been having these little deal of the day type things. And they had a it was 40% off of floor lamps. Not that I needed one. <laughs> I forgot I ordered it, but it's here, chat. I'm gonna show y'all. It's cute. You just had a snack. What was your snack? That's all this is what they do all day. I get groceries and then they suddenly hungry every five minutes. Can I have a snack? Can I have a snack? They're gonna go to that Gigi house and you had a house at home. All right, y'all, I'm finna show y'all. First of all, let's talk about how I, ooh, I got y'all on a, oh, and one of the chairs came for the, um, my step bedroom. They only deliver one. Got it, Tony. His name ain't Tony. That's my daddy's name. I just called him Tony sometimes. Cause I'm copying my mom. Get Maddie, come on in, baby. Come on in, come on in. We're gonna go ahead and get started. Anyway, y'all. Here is the lamp that I got. Oh, it's very heavy. It's probably broke when I fit it. And then let's open this up for the child. Let me get it open and then I'll show y'all. Battery's done anyways. I sat into that um, charger. Tell me. This one gonna take your must. Y'all be able to see me sit down in it. <laughs> Can you turn the light on for me? <laughs> Can you unbox that too? You unbox me, it's your channel. Come on now, make the appearance. Unbox it for me. What are you were in the, in the <laughs> camera view, they can't see you. This chair stank. It's, it smell like chemicals. Don't eat my skin. Oh, it's some scissors. This box is already too. Yeah, it is. It is. Where is that even going? Oh, it's more. Oh. <laughs> Keep on hoping for lamps. This is nice too. I do not need this one. But it was on sale for $40. I was about to say we go in our room, but we got 50 lamps in there already. I bought that lamp in there at my uh, office because you seen it. Here guys, here's the um the light bulb. Not the light bulb. The light. The lamp. The lamp. What are we gonna do with it? Let's see what it looks like in the um what you <laughs> You can see what it looks like in the living room. Everybody chirping though. <laughs> 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 Is the chair up there? Yeah. Okay. Like you do? Yeah. Hey, I can't wait to show y'all. Huh? Uh, makes our room look sophisticated. Not sophisticated. Yeah. All right, y'all, so I purchased these from H&M. Uh, this, one of the two vases, had been out of stock for a while. 
And so I felt inclined to purchase it when it came back in stock. Thinking that it would look good on my dining room table, but honestly, it's too dark. So I'm probably gonna take them back. They remind me of the clear bases that I bought from H&M. Can y'all see it? I love it because it's like a nice textured vase. It looks like a clay vase that you would make, you know? And it's kind of like walk sided, kind of. I haven't opened the other one yet, but I feel like, I don't know. I feel like I can use these somewhere in the house, but then a part of me is like, I don't know if I can or not. If doing too much was a person, <laughs> my name would be plastered right there beside it. <laughs> okay, girls and boys. Here is what the two bases look like. Ooh, don't break it now. I actually like these vases. Okay y'all, so I made some updates to the office, which I think I really like it. So we found a home for the lamp, okay? I also moved the two coffee table things kind of over to the side because I was starting to get annoyed that I didn't have like a lot of walking space in here to my mirror. So the mirror's still centered. I took the Uva stalk that was over in this corner and moved it over there because quite honestly, you couldn't really see it I mean, you could see it whenever you come in. But anyways, I think I may get one more of these. But she has been sold out and I cannot find her anywhere. So I'm about to do some digging. So I may put another one on this side, which is what some people were originally saying when I was doing my office. But I'm just going to, you know, figure something out for now. It'll just stay blank. But I like the way that this looks. And then... My books and stuff are in there, but I have a um, pink blanket or peach, whatever color blanket that goes in there. I just needed to wash it. And then um, these are the vases that I just showed y'all. I decided to stick this plant down in there. So now it's not just like a white plain basic planter. It's so cute. And my forever roses are just down there. And then the other vase I stuck right there on top of this book. I don't really know what this plate doing. But she matches, so she's just going to stay right there. I'll figure something out to put on there. But I think I like this. And now I have this corner filled up. Before I had that small little table thing over there, which wasn't really doing anything. And if you look from this angle now, the cord for the lamp is hidden. So I think it's cute. What do y'all think about the, the switch up in the office? Okay, friends. We are upstairs in the master bedroom. I'm telling y'all now, I did not make my bed today. So, y'all see some. Mind you. Ooh. All right, let me set y'all up. Put y'all right, y'all. She looks lovely already. So, does anybody care to know how it's been going with having been sleeping her crib? <laughs> It's not going. It's just not going. I think I told y'all in the last vlog. We're trying to be consistent with it. But it don't. It don't always work out the way you want it to. So I'll probably end up putting this on my side. I don't want to put this back in her room until she, you know, gets in the mood of actually sleeping in her crib. But my chair so i just got a notification that the other chair will be here tomorrow so i'll show y'all what it looks like with both of them tomorrow but um oh my gosh this has bubbled up so bad i feel like i need just lumbar this is how it would look if i had Obviously, that size pillow, but I think I want to have, I don't know, do y'all think we should have that size pillow to kind of, you know, or should we do like a, just a small, like, lumbar pillow in the seats so you can actually see the, the style of the seat. These are some really good, durable chairs from Target. If you're looking for something inexpensive, I would go with these. I could also change this. Um, I think I definitely... Hold on, y'all. All right, so obviously the lampshade would be way bigger than this, y'all. But I'm thinking that 
I do want the ones that point down. Somebody told me to look at, was it Empire Shades? I haven't looked yet, so I'm gonna see what that looks like. But I'm thinking that I want to do these type of shades. What do y'all think? Cause I just feel like these are so big and bulky that it blocks like a lot of the mirror. And if we have the kind that kind of slant down like this, it would just look a lot sleeker. You know what I'm saying? And also let me know if y'all think I should do, um, I know this is white. So do I need to stick with white or should I do a cream linen with the white? Anyways, I could keep going on and on about that. I just wanted to see what it looked like. If I did try to stick to this color, then I feel like these, these lamps would flow. But to me, the sitting area, as long as everything looks like cohesive, like it's meant to be in the same room, I feel like the sitting area could have its own different color lamp because like I told y'all in the last vlog, cream, tan, white, and black is... And then obviously the hardware and these pillows are giving off like that brass gold type color. But it'll come together. I'll show y'all what it looks like when we get the other chair. And then obviously I'm supposed to be doing curtains in here. <laughs> I could do, I don't know what color curtain rod. Y'all let me know what color curtain rod should I do. A brass curtain rod um, or should I do a black curtain rod to bring in more black from that. And then for the curtains what color should they be i feel like we're getting a little bit drowned out with cream in here um i don't know if i should do like a like a sheer type curtain or if i should just do cream if i should do tan y'all let me know because right now i'm not seeing the vision good morning friends so we got to um oh do some cleaning downstairs but i just had to come tell y'all something that was so embarrassing girl um i think your name is bama something she come in on my video and was like um she said something about she had come in on my video one of my vlogs a long time ago see i know in the last vlog i was telling y'all how i um, show y'all the show y'all the lamps that my lamps in my master bedroom are duped for and she was like I think you have the book by that designer. I said I know you want And I know in my office I had a book that said Kelly something and I literally y'all probably just seen it yesterday when I was showing y'all my office Girl, I looked this morning The book is by that lady. I right, look at this this book says Kelly Wierschler. Girl, how embarrassing. And it's so funny because this book, I, I, I thought when I bought the book that it was very like different, you know what I'm saying? Like I like the color schemes, which goes along with the look of the lamp. I commented back and I said, girl, that just goes to show that I really just be buying the book for how it looks and not really for what's in it and <laughs> what it says. That's probably a lot of us. But can we take a moment for my office? I like it so much better, especially this little area over here because it looks so bland before. Now it's just, <laughs> but I do, I do need y'all to comment and tell me if I should put another shelf right here. I kind of like it being bare. I almost want to get like, um, a cabinet or something where I can actually file things, y'all. I, I told y'all I was gonna clean up. It know it, it know it. I just don't want it to be crowded. But another shelf would look nice. It just means I gotta buy more schnit to put on it. Anyways, today, um, y'all won't see this in time, but CB2 is having a 20% off flash sale on the core wall art. So there's this cream or white bowl that I'm about to buy because I think I'm gonna put <clears throat> switch that one out for that green base that I have at the bottom of the black cabinet in our room just to brighten it up so it'll be dark, light, dark, light. Or if I get another shelf, I'll be able to put it on there. And the entryway, not entryway side, well, the, y'all hear me? <laughs> she mad because she has to there with her daddy. Um, the console and the bre breakfast nook area. I don't know why this is a tongue twister to me. Anyways, 
that is where I need some more stuff to put to. But that's not going to be here until December, so long, long, long way from now. Anyways, I'm about to go clean up. The other thing that I needed to show y'all today is the um, second chair. So just the complete look of what it looks like up there. And then, I already locked this door? Huh. Um, is the... Um, the second chair that comes in, just what that complete completed space looks like. And then I'm gonna close up the vlog. I haven't edited this vlog yet. I don't know how long it's gonna be, but we got time. And then, whoop, whoop, no, we're gonna hang that picture today. So I'll show y'all that. We might actually end up moving the other two pictures down some, and then I'll show y'all that, and then we'll close up the vlog. We'll just close up the vlog at the end of the day. Whatever gets done on this Tuesday, it'll get put in Wednesday vlog, okay? Better y'all. I will see you guys later. Look at the the mess. And do you hear the silence outside of Bean? My kids want to stay with their Gigi for the entire week. So, although they're normally my help with Bean, like they they keep her during the day, and like I pay them to to watch her so that they don't feel like it's an obligation. It feels like it's a job. I don't know. I'm trying to like lighten. <laughs> That whole thing, cause I don't want them getting older. Be like, yeah, I had to keep my baby. But at the same time, who didn't have to watch their baby sisters and brothers and stuff like that? Anyways, they want to stay over there, so it is very helpful. I am so thankful for their grandparents. Um, so they get to stay over there, and even though I don't have help with Bean, besides like me and my husband, we were both working. His work is a little bit more <laughs> clearly um, than mine, but. It's helpful because like, you know, your older kids are not as dependent as like a baby, but they still require a lot. My kids are very high energy, so they still require attention just in a different form than what the baby requires. So the constant having to clean up after them or getting on to them about doing certain things, it gets overwhelming. I'm not going to lie. Like I've been very overwhelmed and like emotional here lately. Um... And I know I just needed a break. So even though Bean is still here, um, you know, she'll go down for her naps. She cries, but I can kind of, you know, pop blue with her mouth and she's quiet. But, um, and then this weekend for my friend's birthday, we're doing a mom staycation type thing in Atlanta. So um, she got like a cabana at, I forgot what the name of the hotel is. So we're doing that. We're doing massages. We're having dinner. And then the next day we're doing brunch. It's just like a whole, we all have kids. So it's going to be nice. So it's nice to have like a little break and then be completely kid free for like a day and some change. So I'm excited. And I'll do like a montage of our weekend. They know that I vlog. I don't know if they watch my vlogs, but they know that I vlog. So. They don't mind me having the camera out and we like to do reels and stuff like that together. If you follow me, oh excuse me, if you follow me on Instagram, any of the reels where I'm with other girls, those are the girls that I'll be with this weekend. So, anyways, let me clean up so that I can work. All right, y'all, so here is what it looks like with the two chairs. So these are not the pillows that are gonna go in here. These pillows are actually from Either the living room or the um, guest bedroom. I don't know where my husband pulled them from. But here is a view of what it looks like from here. And then we put the two black pillows over there so that we could see what it looked like trying to bring the black over here. And we also thought of getting a rug to go under the bed that would um, have... Is somebody calling me? Oh, she's trying to turn on my voice name that would have black in it to bring more black in here also said we would get a black curtain ride cream we just don't even want to fool with the black even said we were going to get black to go over there on the west name long story short we are going to return this cabinet i love the cabinet i love the way that the cabinet is styled but honestly it just is just not working in here and i can tell that my husband don't really like it so it makes me not like it obviously um because i want both of us to both of us to be 100 percent in love with whatever we have in here so i'm gonna take it back 
um and whatever the stuff is that i have in here i'll just end up using it somewhere else in the house so um my thought is to get a floor link mirror to go over here that matches the mirrors over here i know some people think it's crazy to have multiple mirrors in their room but i've seen it in rooms before and i like the idea of you can never have enough mirrors in my opinion but <laughs> um let me know what y'all think about the fact that we're taking this bag i guess it don't make a difference at this point because i mean here's the thing y'all like he literally has asked me about this cabinet multiple times and he's made comments about the cabinet multiple times and it's like bad read the writing on the wall i don't like it so then he comes in and he's like are you sure you like the chairs because i know how you are are you gonna be trying to buy new chairs okay yes i'll give him that i do do get bored very easily i like changing things up but i love these chairs so i'm not gonna change them and i already told y'all the whole reason for buying going with the inexpensive option with the chairs anyways i just come here to tell y'all we're getting rid of the table my nose is ashy too i don't know why my skin has been drying out lately not pick you up i'm not gonna do it yes i am hold on say hey <laughs> you're so cute say hey friends <laughs> so yeah um that's where we are now we're just gonna get rid of it and then when i think i showed y'all the gold pillows in the seats earlier and i don't know i just feel like that color pops more my husband tried it out he was like yeah i think we just keep it light tone so i'm listening i'm listening i'm listening but anyways so i'm gonna return this and then i am going to put a picture up of the um fluted tables that i want to go over there they're also cream maybe off-white i don't know but i think i'm gonna get a set of two sorry if y'all can't hear me bean can you just be quiet a minute so i can talk to my friends thank you i'm gonna get one right there one right there so it's probably like about there and then there so yeah but yeah um we are gonna close out the vlog right here miss loud mouth yeah we're closing out the vlog right here um i'm not showing y'all the picture in the bre breakfast nook area because we had to fill the hole so right now the putty filler whatever it is it's drying <laughs> so we probably won't put it up until tomorrow or the day after before sunday hopefully um so yeah but thank y'all so much for watching. Thank you for your continued support. All of the above. And me and Benny will see y'all on Sunday. Say, so, Elit. Elit, do you want to show them that you know how to jump? Why is you doing that? Y'all, watch her jump real quick. Hold on. Bean. Watch this. Jump. 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 <laughs> Babe. Yeah, come here. Jump. Yeah, you did it. Get up and jump again. Jump. 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 Good job. Say yay. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>